All right, guys, I'm going to show you or remind you how to add fractions that have a common denominator. So that means the number down the bottom of the fraction, the two fractions we're adding, is the same. Sorry. So the number at the bottom of the fraction is the same. <clears throat> First example we'll do is one fifth plus three fifths. I know you don't have this at home, but you can either print it out. I've got it on the portal, or there's a um, virtual one you can use um, where you can actually move the fraction around, fra fractions around uh, on your computer. Okay, so the first thing I'm doing is taking out one fifth, and I'm adding to that one fifth. Another three fifth. One, two, three. So now I have one, two, three, four fifth. Next one I'm going to do is two sevenths plus three seventh. Again, I start with my two sevenths. And I add another three seventh to that. Now I have one, two, three, four, five, seventh. And I record that. Next, I will do three eighths plus four eighths. And another four. One, two, three, four. I now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eighths. And that's recorded. Okay. 